Applause and cheers you may have heard today from Widener Stadium downtown wasn't from a switchback soccer match. It was in response to Governor Jared Polis's annual State of the State address, today's version tailored specifically for the Pikes Peak region. KRDO News Channel 13 Scott Harrison has a recap in a story that's new at 10. Fresh from the Nuggets Championship Parade in Denver. How about those Nuggets, everybody? Although I know that It'll only be a matter of time till the switchbacks bring the USL championship right back here to Colorado Springs. Colorado Governor Jared Polis took to the podium at Widener Field with apartment construction overlooking the field to discuss what he feels is the state's most important issue, housing, the high cost and the low supply. Uh, they frequently squeezed out the most affordable kind of inventory, housing inventory we need. Think entry level homes, duplexes, quadplexes, for rental, accessory, dwelling units, these are the kinds of homes that tend to be more affordable and are often harder to build. And yes, Colorado Springs has done better than many cities. The governor says that the legislature made progress this year on the housing crisis and will continue doing more. With an unprecedented coalition around housing, I mean, there are very few things that bring the chamber and the business community together with the environmental community, together with workers groups and unions, uh, like the need to create more housing that people can afford close to where jobs are. The 400 people in the audience generally liked what Polis said about the state of the Colorado Springs area, with at least one exception. What I would like to hear more about is maybe Colorado infrastructure, a little bit more on the homeless uh, pandemic that we have going on. Uh, but overall, it looks like our economy is strong here in Colorado Springs. The governor closed with something most of us here in Southern Colorado hope will happen. And of course, we will be excited, along with Mayor Yemi, to hopefully announce at some point soon that Space Command will remain here in Colorado Springs. In downtown Colorado Springs, Scott Harrison, KRDO, News Channel 13.